As we continue to recognize Climate Week here in New York, we take a look at our neighbor, New Jersey. The Garden State, sticking true to its name, launched a climate change curriculum for all public school students this year. New Jersey, the first state to implement climate change into its school curriculum. The state says it plans to teach climate change across K through 12th grade, aiming to give every student the opportunity to study and understand the climate crisis by giving them the tools and knowledge to combat climate change. The woman spearheading this is the first lady of New Jersey and the wife to Governor of course, who is of New Jersey, Governor Murphy, Tammy Murphy, First Lady. We are delighted to have you with us. Thank you for being here. This legislation was signed back in 2020. What was the significance then and now to include a climate change curriculum into New Jersey schools? Well, good morning. Thank you for having me. Uh, I would say that the importance is that, you know, Climate change is, is really becoming a reality. I think we all know that. Uh, you can look around the world, whether it's Pakistan that's, you know, has a third of the country under water right now or wildfires raging across the United States, droughts in, in Asia. And here in our own backyard in New Jersey, we have our own challenges, whether it's sea level rise or microbursts or algal blooms. Uh, and, you know, as a mother of four, I feel probably uh, echoing most parents that I would love to leave my children with a future that is at least comparable to the one that I have, the life I've lived. And I want to make sure that, that the next generation of students and those who come after have the skill set necessary to be able to uh, win and succeed at the incredible jobs that are going to be available as we all shift towards a, a greener economy. So within this curriculum, how will students be able to learn about how climate change affects them locally and globally? So, uh, first of all, you should know that, that it's um, probably the silver lining of the pandemic is that this curriculum was going to be rolled out last year. And so we've had an extra full year. Um, the Department of Education and all of our incredible educators uh, across New Jersey have had another a year to really figure out what their lesson plans will be, to engage in professional development, and to really hone in on, on what they are actually going to teach at the different grade levels. Uh, the Department of Education has created uh, a website and a toolkit for uh, our, our educators uh, to be able to you know, access, um, you know, whether it's lesson plans or videos or advocacy or, or whatever, whatever things they might need, as well as obviously professional development. And the Department of Education is going around and working with individual school districts to make sure that if there's anything that we have missed, uh, that we are able to hone that for those teachers. Um, one, yeah, well, I was going to say ahead. that makes sense, but I, I was going to ask you how the teachers specifically will be supported. Uh, they're supported through the Department of Ed. They're supported through uh, our office. And, you know, I, I'd say that the districts themselves are able to design whatever it is that the way that they want to implement and interpret uh, these this new um, this new education standard. And so I would say that, you know, if, if, if teachers need something, um, there is absolutely a feedback system and, and we're able to help them. Uh, I, I know that most teachers are very excited. If not, all the teachers are really excited. We've gotten great initial feedback from them on this. And, and one thing you might want to know is before we even uh, started working on these standards, uh, I went around the state and visited easily, you know, 10 to 15 schools. And, the, and many of these schools were already doing things, um, innovative things in their classrooms to expose uh, the next generation to climate change, to sustainability, to resilience. Uh, and so there, there's there's a lot that's been going on even before we are mandating these the, this, uh, this new curriculum. All right, well, it is amazing effort. Thank you, First Lady Tammy Murphy of New Jersey. Delighted to have you with us, thank you. Thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.